Well, Inger, it's the story stunning Americans day after day. Thousands of undocumented children being held in U.S. immigration centers until the government can figure out what to do. In this Not In Your Side Immigration Watch, a disturbing first of its kind update on the conditions of the kids, courtesy first of these pictures obtained exclusively by ABC News. They show kids being held by U.S. Customs and Border Protection in cages on concrete floors. This coinciding with allegations of horrific neglect and abuse in Texas. Now, in your science, Maggie Vespa has been pouring through these reports just, just released today, and she's in the newsroom with more on this. Maggie. That's right, guys. Stella, this complaint filed today with the Department of Homeland Security contains just some of the horrific stories told to human rights workers by kids identified only by their initials while they were detained at CBP facilities, again, in Texas. Before this story airs, we want to warn you, these details are graphic. They are the kids the world is watching, and tonight, allegations that someone isn't watching closely enough. In these reports, more than 100 children as young as five describe being strip-searched and shackled, being denied food and medication. This as they sit in freezing cold cells with lights on 24-7 so they couldn't sleep. Among groups sounding the alarm, the American Civil Liberties Union. The federal government needs to do what it, it needs to provide additional resources immediately to deal with this humanitarian crisis. A crisis that for some gets much more graphic. First, DG, a 16-year-old girl who says during a search, CBP officers violently spread her legs and touched her genital areas forcefully making her scream. A boy, MV, also 16, says officers accused him of lying about his age, threatening if he didn't tell the truth, he would become the wife of a male detainee. Finally, 15-year-old KM, who tells of being detained with a girl covered in bruises on her chest and face. When questioned, the girl said a CBP official took her into a cave and raped her. We want um, greater oversight by DHS. We want the, them to comply with the law. We want them to treat these kids with humanity and dignity and respect they deserve. Not on your side, reached out to the Department of Homeland Security and released a statement in response saying they strive to protect unaccompanied children and adults, adding, quote, in the face of overwhelming numbers of unaccompanied children crossing the border, agents have taken extraordinary measures to care for these children while in custody and maintain security in overcrowded facilities.